Hey Royals, the 2021 spring season is fastly approaching and as part of my Spring It On Home series, we're talking all things bedroom makeover. Guys, I'm sharing with you a makeover from bedrooms of spring past. You guys know of my love for all things blue, Tiffany blue being my signature color. I could not resist this beautiful champagne and Tiffany blue combination. You guys, I always love to style up my bed using layers of texture and bringing in items to give you visual interest. So you'll always see me use a comfortable throw, some nice little tray styling, a variation of pillow sizes, and so much more just to build on that added comfort. Didn't realize it, but I repeated this exact same color scheme for the following season. Again, same concept, layers and layers of lush textures and fabrics with the faux fur, the tweed designs, beaded pillows, damask designs, and so much more. Changed up the placement of the throw, added in a few more accessories, and voila! The bedroom was styled perfectly for the spring season. You'll often hear me speak of shopping my home, and that is what I do season after season. I may transfer one color scheme to another space, and it'll totally give me a totally new look and feel. And I would advise you to do the same. You don't always have to break the bank to bring on a new look and feel into a space. From every angle, you guys, this bedroom screamed comfort. It screamed spring. It screamed luxe. Well, I decided to switch it up. You guys, this year I introduced a new color palette to my home. And it is all things ebony and ivory. You guys, I love this winter white and romantic black scheme that I created this year. I have found a new love for all things black and you'll see shades of it throughout my home throughout this season. For Valentine's, I did this beautiful combination. Again, my same technique of layering on lush fabrics, plush pillows, decadent desserts, and so much more. And what could be more romantic for the Valentine theme than this beautiful bouquet by Roses Forever? I will have a link in my description box so you guys can take advantage of these beautiful roses. They last up to a year and they will be perfect for Mother's Day, birthdays, or just a thinking of you type of gift. So make sure you check that out in my description box. Now getting back to the max bedroom makeover of it all, you guys. I so love this color scheme. For one reason, because it was different and new for my typical styling. And two, the hubby seemed to really enjoy this color palette. I carried it throughout the space, keeping my background neutral and just adding pops of black throughout. And that's another tip for you all. When you're styling your space, choose a neutral backdrop. So that way you can switch out your colors from season to season or just whenever you get a whim to change. I loved it so much, in fact, that even after Valentine's, I kept it around. Brought in a little bit more texture and dimension. I added more pillows, changed out the layout of the throw, and voila, this was a pre-spring design. But I'm really kind of torn, you guys. And as a treat to you all, I'm sharing with you this one spring design, but I couldn't decide. I love the black and it is so rich and it's regal and it speaks of all things royalty. I don't think you can ever have enough pillows. I think the textures and sizes play beautifully with each other. And I get so much joy when I enter the space. And that's what you want to achieve when styling any space, whether your bedroom, your bathroom, your living room, family room, whatever. You want to have that spark of joy when you enter into your space and comfort. This room is so cozy, you guys. 
Again, I kept with the roses forever because they are beautiful and timeless. And I love to add a touch of romance to every bedroom styling that I do. I carried the color over from the window treatments to the wall decor. I really got into the ebony and ivory of it all. Even changed out the pillows. Simply again, you guys, shopping my home to bring in a new look and feel. And I stated earlier that I'm torn because I love this black and white design or as I call it, ebony and ivory design. You guys know that I am a lover of all things blue. So I want you to help me decide, should I keep the ebony and ivory? How about a little Tiffany and Company? I absolutely love this, you guys, with this pop of blush pink. It screams spring. It's so true to my signature look and feel. Again, same formula, you guys. If you take the proper design formula, you can apply it to any space, any color scheme, and get the same result. Layers after layer after layer of texture dimension and so much coziness in this space i absolutely love this little rabbit i found off season of course i added a few floral picks in the back another rose forever bouquet you guys and this acrylic box and it just set the ambiance for spring romance now you tell me which should i keep because you won't know what i actually chose well i'm gonna let you decide should it be option one, ebony and ivory, or should I go with this soft Tiffany and company? Leave a comment in the description box letting me know which one you guys prefer. Along with your comment, leave a black heart for ebony and ivory and a blue heart for the Tiffany and company design. I cannot wait to see with you all. Decide. Majority wins. Let's have fun with it. You will see the number one choice during the spring home tour. If you see what you like and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button and join the royal family. As you can see, we are full of inspiration, motivation, and creativity. If you haven't already, connect with me on my other social media platforms, Royalty Designs on all stations. To my brand new boos and my tried and trues, you guys know that I so love and appreciate you. Thank you all for your continued support. Stick around because there's so much more to come in my Spring It On series. And you don't want to miss a single upload. Until the next video, stay safe, be royal, and have a blessed and most beautiful, beautiful day.